Hello everybody! Welcome to Charlotte Wars Adventures! Here we're going to be playing some No Man's Sky and yeah, I don't know, I just figured I'm going to hop into this. I wanted to do a video on this game for such a long time. They've recently updated their game here and yeah, and so, you know, let's see, recently as in very in the last week or so, uh, they've had their synthesis update and we're going to explore the game you know, within that new update and, and further and beyond. I've been playing this game for, for quite a while. I've probably was it played this for... I can't even sh uh, show you all. Um, I've played this game for quite a while. I have played it for about 150 hours or more. So yeah, so I think I know what I'm doing. I hope so. I'm always open to tips and ideas, and yeah. So what are we going to do? What's on the agenda today? Well, basically, I'm going to hop into my ship, or my freighter here, and I'm going to fly it to the next system, because we're making our way towards the Atlas, and yeah, I'm going to continue to play this game as I always do. And hopefully all of you will enjoy my content. You know, someone who I've been watching for for some time now, um, someone who I recommend to all of you would be a Procedural Traveler. He's kind of the guy that got me back into doing the videos, so I apologize if everything is sloppy and everything is, is uneasy, blah blah blah. Yeah, well, it's going to be the way it is. I'm no professional, I'm just some guy that's playing this game and wants to make some videos and maybe try and interact with a few people about the game. It's a very awesome game and it's, I just want people to see this game for what it is. And, and yeah, um, I'm probably in the advanced stages of the game. I have most of everything unlocked. And it's more of now just playing the game and enjoying it and, building a massive base that's kind of why I want to start recording again it's the idea that got me back into YouTube again uh, due to watching procedural traveler do his videos and so yeah so here we go so uh, why am I talking to this guy I don't know why I'm talking to this guy transfer items from ship to freighter I guess that's you can transfer everything uh, this guy you can have him so I'm in a freighter basically and what this is is for most people who don't know most people should know I guess I'm not sure you know how many of you are experienced with the game but my experience with this game is I'm using this to travel around to save on the warp cores so for example there's the uh, the hyperdrive system in your ship I'm kind of bypassing this and I'm using the freighter because I think at the moment it costs absolutely nothing. If you look in our freighter inventory, I have four of these and one of these and I've been traveling a few, like a few jumps and I don't think it goes down at all, but I'll show you. So if we go into here, I play this game on the PC. So that's why you'll see, you'll see all the, the controls with like PC designations like F to set waypoint, escape to leave, right click to deselect certain system or current system. That will all be like that. And uh, we're going to warp, but I think what we're going to do first is I can't warp. I have to complete an expedition uh, with these things that you capture or you can get uh, with the freighters. You can buy these little ships that which then you can send on, on missions. That's what I'm going to do right now. We're supposed to be able to fix these ships, but I haven't been able to fix one. I don't know if, if I'm missing something, or but maybe some of you could comment down below how we fix these ships. Uh, you know, maybe it's right in front of my face and I just haven't paid attention. I'm, I'm pretty bad that way. But let's go debrief. And this is cool, and I wanted to do a video about this because it's really neat. Uh, you log entry 261, encountered abandoned starship drifting through Shoban XVI system towed into mothership hangar. No trace of pilot. Ship process for valuable metals. 29,000 units. Oh my god. Uh, 
<laughs> ground crew encountered colossal underwater creatures while searching for hydrothermal vents slow moving and docile they they gathered around the vents for warmth creatures appeared to enjoy being scanned viking fng surveyed blah 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 solar activity at 51 percent expected maximum sack venom so yeah so you can collect items and whatnot it's really cool and i'm going to complete this mission this expedition we collect our items like as per usual and then now we can take off so let's see let's go traveling to our next destination our next destination is basically towards the atlas but i do want to stop in a place to build i just haven't found the perfect system to build in so we're just going to head towards this one and we will just boogie there shabam perfecto look at that we made it safely out of warp here we are let's check this out okay uh, i also don't mind changing the color of my suit uh, warp 60 times woo overseer i'm glad that it counts so now i know <laughs> <laughs> oh man oh yeah you know what before we do anything maybe oh yeah that's uh part of the storyline that's uh, one of these ones purge or i can't remember one of these is it's giving me these these sequences for something uh, i can't remember yeah but there's 16 of them <laughs> and so i imagine uh, I, I have 10 out of 16, so I imagine once I have all 16, I can then go to a portal and uh, trigger it. But I have no clue, but if anyone out there knows who's watching this, <laughs> if you're still watching this, uh, I doubt very many people are, very many people are going to watch this. It's, yeah. But if you are, thank you. I appreciate it. Uh, I definitely want to share my experiences. I think this is how I'm going to do it. I've gotten to the point in the game where I've gotten, well, whatever, you might not hear proper English for words, but whatever, that's that's fine. Uh, oh, we already warped, okay, so let's get out of this, get out of this. I always like to check the system after warping, uh, but we should do an expedition, that's what I wanted to do. So, plan and dispatch. So... New potential expeditions. So basically, it shows you a rating and whatnot. Um, but how do we fix our ships? I really need to fix our ships. There needs to be. There's research terminal, warp map, uh, manage fleet. Maybe this is what we do. Okay, so there's a damage component. I want to fix it. But where's the damage component? I don't see it damaged here. You see this? You know, you'd think there'd be like a component and then there would be something going on, but I do not see that at all, at all. But D to next, you see this ship, this is our exploration specialist ship. Uh, 20 exploration, this is our industrial ship with ore processing unit. So yeah, so this is for trade, this is for exploration, industrial. Now I just need some combat ships. A couple combat ships, and then we have our fleet, so to speak. And it kind of tells you how many successful... Oh, I wonder what this stuff is. This rank. You know, do you think we can rank these up? Maybe? I don't know. If someone out there knows, you can tell me. But yeah, but how do we fix a component when there's nothing broken? <laughs> See? So... This is damaged. But is it damaged? I don't know. You tell me. Tell me how to access that. That's I'm curious about that. So yeah, the, unless that's one of the the few bugs this game still has. They have cleaned up a lot of bugs. This new update. Uh, it's like a version 2.24 or something like that at the time of this recording. And yeah, so that's where you'll see that. So let's carry on here. Let's carry on. I'm also going to try and keep these as natural as possible. I was trying to have a more contrived feel to everything, but I don't know. I, I'm, I'm going to do my I'm going to do my best to to not to have a more natural 
I'm probably not going to edit these out, so there might be <laughs> some issues that usually are edited out. Hopefully all the sound comes through correctly. Hopefully the quality comes out nice. This is all a first pop. With this, it's been a while. So let's hop into one of our ships. I do have more. I have this spaceship here that I definitely want to start using. <laughs> I bought that one recently. And then there's a couple other ships. That will be the new fighter ship that I have. And that will be a new exploration ship until we can get rid of this one. But this is the one I've been using for most of the game, just because it is a class A. Uh, wrong interface. It's class A. And the only problem is the slots. Slots. The slots are horrible. <laughs> so, what do I need to do? How can I fix my slot issue here? I don't know. I don't know, because this is uh, the main weapon is this ejector or ejector. Positron, this is how I, I kill everything with. I can't get rid of this gun. Oh, can I rewire it? Oh, yes. Dang, there we go. That's an extra slot. Okay, let's let's take off here and explore this system. So so I've been basically doing like Star Trek been coming to like a system and then I've been exploring the system. Seeing if there's a viable place to land on. Uh, activated copper, uranium, salt. So no, uh, it's probably gonna have radiation on it. Uh, let's see, they've they've changed the interface. So in the middle, you can kind of see the planets and stuff now. Does this system only have two planets? Uh, copper, ammonia. Yeah. Okay, this place sucks. I don't see any other planets. Just these two. So uh, another way of checking is to go into our discoveries. And the system here will show you. This shows you if you land on the planet. Let's upload. You can upload all your discoveries. And then you receive nanites. Nanites are useful for purchasing ship upgrades and researches and etc. So you'll want to collect as many of those as you can. Quicksilver is what they use in the event. Which I'll show you here a little bit later. And the units. When I show you the event, um, I'm probably going to stop recording. I'll accept the quest, stop recording it, and I might record bits and pieces of what I do. I'm not 100% on that because I don't want to spoil the, the weekly events, but then I could record the whole thing and get it done if it's something easy, um, if it's something complex where it takes a long time. I don't know how long this video is going to be. Don't know how long it already is. It's probably what about 10 minutes or so, 12 minutes. So yeah, let's carry on. Let's see how much we can pound out. So definitely, we're not going to care about this system. Uh, perilous conflict level, which <laughs> which means that I can be attacked at any moment right now. This is my kind of system, perilous and whatnot, but. Unfortunately, for for this base I want to build, this could be needs to be in a more safe environment, and it needs to be on a planet that has the resources that I need. So that is the other aspect. We are back. Here is our wonderful bridge area. I haven't gone upstairs actually. Let's go check upstairs. Are there more areas to build up here, or is it just a decorative until they add more? Let's see here. Look at that, this is new. What's this guy? Freighter crew. Feel a multitude of entities watching through. Oh, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. If you want to read it, pause it. <laughs> uh, okay, so this is nothing right now. Maybe this would be useful for something. Fighter, or freighter crew. Oh, okay, no, no, sorry. It's just an NPC. Dang it. Okay, never mind. I thought there was maybe something useful up here, but no. It, uh, how can I interact with these? No. Okay, there's nothing useful. Look out the window. Oh, wow, look at that. Is there kind of weird, weird glass? Okay, here we go. I'm raw. I'm overseeing operations. <laughs> okay, sure. Let us warp again, sir. 
Manage Fleet. Okay. Um, no, sorry, not Manage Fleet. One, two. Freighter warp map. There we go. Permission. No, it should be Atlas Station. There we go. Deselect. So this one's hyperdrive has no fuel. Oh, maybe it does take fuel. I thought it didn't. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, maybe freighter. Ah. 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 Never mind. Okay. So you do have to charge this. Never mind, folks. Okay. My bad. It does use warp. I'm going to use this one on it. Because I imagine it's probably better. Uh, the next time we get to zero, maybe we'll try the little one just to see what it does. See how many it needs. That's something new they added. They added you basically click on the thing to charge and boof. So damn. So never mind. Okay. So my bad. I've learned the reality that we do have to pay for all the warps. So it doesn't matter if we use this or our ship. So we might as well use this one and then our ship from the inside. Interesting. So I haven't warped yet. I thought we did. But we have no fuel, so if I deselect, it's the green. Oh, current mission. I see the current mission's back. So if I go, there we go, Atlas Path. So what is this G0? Let's check out this system. This might be the one to build on. It's in the middle of nowhere. Let's see. Only paths the resources we need. Okay, well, I'll spare you the theatrics. I'll beat you up the ship. Yay, our wonderful, beautiful ship. Now let us go out. Ooh, we got a ship landing. Hello, sir. Leave it. Okay. Ah, no. Why would you be talking to me, buddy? Why is this guy talking to me? You're not alone. You can't go to the center. You can't do this. You can't leave us. Oh yeah, this is the other guy. No. Say you are real. Go on. Can't do this You can't. Set at the center. Well, it's the Atlas. It's all else just interfaces of all else. The shadow of its might. You, you don't deserve it. You, you wipe us all. To save. No. I did what I had to do. I told you that. You couldn't die seeing everything there was to see, too. Did what I had to do with the Atlas. It won't let me back in. It won't speak to me. It, it, that's what Null did. I've committed such atrocities, Traveler. I had to. It was me or them. It's always been me or them. Please, if you go through the center, if you do what I did, it will reset everything. It will replace me, wipe me. All those souls will have died for nothing. It's the only way to live on. You have to understand me. Life for more life. They sustained me. They. And all been for nothing. I was going to see it all. The buy has no screens. I mean, there's nothing left but the path towards the center. I wonder if I did that one correctly or fall or wrong. So yeah, hopefully I did that one correct. So we are in this system here. So let us space station. Let's scan this planet. Back to uh, uranium, so high sentinel activity. Yeah, I don't know if I want that. The building a base where there's lots of sentinels, as long as they, they leave you alone, is fine. But if they attack, so there's the only two planets in this system, too. Man, so our yellow system's crappy? Because those are common, the yellow systems. Okay, so they're normal. I would consider those normal. 
Okay. So that's it, just two planets. Okay, let's go back. No point in uh, trying to... So damn it, I was wrong about the, the hyperdrive stuff. I guess you can hyper around a long time before it uses up the fuel, I guess. Because I haven't had to fill it up at all that I can recall. Unless you go on a quest when you first get it to fill it, but... That is definitely something interesting. Perfect, here we go. Let's check this out. So obviously there's nothing here. I should visit this... Oh, dang it, dang it. I should have visited the, uh, the space station, but whatever. Uh, I don't think that matters, but that station. So deselect. Okay. Where are we going? We are going this way. It's that. Why is there a dotted line there? There's like different lines. Maybe they're different quests in different directions. I don't know. Or one of them is the warp line. Ah, whatever. Here we go. We're going to this Atlas one here. The other systems nearby. No, this is all strictly yellow. Which, interesting. Okay, let's go to that one. Shoot. Yay, we survived another warp. Have we gotten cancer and died yet? Atlas interface discovered. Yes, we will be heading there. I'll show you what the... Oh, and there's the data injection as, as per usual here. Wonderful, 12 out of 16. I didn't show the one of them uh, that we got the last time because that wasn't really important. Here we go. Let's see if we can. Whew. Okay. Let's take off. Let's get off this this whole th freighter. Okay. Let's stretch our legs. Ah! <laughs> oh man. Oh boy. There's the Atlas interface. How many worlds are there here? So there's one. Big one. Copper, paraffinium, silver, star bulb, salvageable scrap. Let's check it out, actually. We are going to go down. I'll show you what it's like to fly down towards. Uh, uh, there's ships here. I wish you could kind of get an idea what the ships are from just looking at them, but I don't really see what they are from the outside. So I imagine those are exploration ships. Uh, these should be... These frigates here should be like attack frigates or something. Let's take a look at this one here. There we go. I don't know why it flips the ship around, but... Spec frigates. Ah, this is a combat one. So let's purchase that, hey? So these small ones are the combat ones. Interesting. Okay, well, let's do it. Let's do it. It's only a couple million. So we got one ship. What's this ship here? Let's see what he has. That's an industrial one. Class C, so no, we don't want it. Okay, cool. That is it. Let's check the planet out now. Let's just uh, phase or pulse jump. Boom, okay. Let's see what this planet is. We're gonna fly through the atmosphere here. This is the best part of the game is just Transitioning to and from space to to planet. There's no zones, no no crap. This is your zone right here. You don't notice it, but ooh, there's an ocean here. What the f? Oh my god. Shit. Okay. 
Woo! Excuse the swearing, but dang. Whoa. What's that? Why is there like so weird? So is that stuff in space probably? So where where can, where are there wow, this is an ocean, right? This is, yeah, this is ocean, it's clear. Oh, I don't know what happens when you crash in water. I don't wanna find out. I don't like the sound of this world. <laughs> So where the heck are we? Wow. Like, there is absolutely nothing on this world. How, how can we land on these areas? Maybe right here. Maybe this is a good place to build. I don't know. Holy crap. Let's see if we can... Uh, Let's see here, what's going on here? Wow. Holy crap, is there anything on this world? Flora, abundant, fauna, rich. Sure, it's all ocean here. Fascinating. Bet you there's underwater stuff here. So we would have to build a whole it's a clean slate because it's flat. Or maybe there's other areas to the planet. Oh wow, look at this. This is uh, definitely <laughs> a vast ocean here. Holy crap. Man, what, what, what world is this? We're definitely going to have to come back to this one. I, I wanted to build on here, but not now. Not with an ocean. You could, you can build ocean bases and whatnot, but that's not the point. I don't feel like doing that right now. I need to build a farm, so I need I need uh, lots of space. And so I guess we'll do the atlas. We'll fly on over there. Let's see here. This is part of the game, so I'm going to show a lot of this. In the first few episodes, I think eventually we'll cut it out. But for now, I, I want to show you kind of what this game is. And this is a lot of it is traveling. It's part of the journey. And here we go. Whoa. Okay, here we go. Here's the big Atlas interface. More ships coming in, of course. God, let's go. Perfect, here we go. I don't know why it, it, it flies so slow, maybe just for that extra oomph. go yes this turns around like as per usual <laughs> okay excellent so on here on these atlases you want to pick these up because you learn words so every time you come to the atlas make sure you 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 run around and grab those words so what I usually do is I usually drop down and I'll grab a side of them and then when I make my way back, I'll make sure to hit all uh, them all up. So, because back here there's uh, stairs, so I do the one side of them, and then on the way back, from interacting with that thing, I go back the other direction. Now I'm, I'm not sure what the purpose of this is, why I'm interacting with these atlases, and you know they're giving me these things I can craft. But I'm not sure if they're for sale or if you're supposed to use them in something else, you know, like, in, you know, like a different part of the game. I haven't really figured that out yet. Maybe I haven't spent enough time in the game yet to 
to understand that part of it. I don't know. Maybe someone can comment down below. <laughs> can educate me. Uh, too funny. Yep, and so there's walking in this game. This is how fast the walking goes. Okay. Woo. Fancy graphics. Woo. Okay, let's interact with you, buddy boy. Bring us meeting if you are capable. Ah, okay. What is learned can ever be unlearned. I'm afraid I've seen too much. There are glimpses, have remembered visions of a time before time. I see the birth of the first star. I see the things that dwelt within it. The eyes that watched. I see what the Atlas saw at the moment of its activation. Atlas stones are not stones. This station is not a station. I'm not what I think I am. I'm not even sure that I exist. The Atlas does not care. The Atlas demands its threnody, its repetition sublime. Milestone curiosity or above. So I think I have that one. The voice of destination calls to me. See, it's creating these product formulas like photic jade. So do I have photic jade? Photic jade. So go into here. Yeah, okay, so state, phaser, photic jade, which, which uses dawn. So, so I don't know, do I have to craft these, but for what, right? Like, so for example, there's dawn's end, and there's dark matter. See, they all kind of build off of each other. Now uh, is it neosphere, and then there's a globe shade, and there's capture nano. Capture nano is just... So, like, for example, we can do that, right? Then we can build the the next one. I wish these were kind of... So we can build that one, right? Then we can build... Um, where is it? This one? Right? So, so, see, so... Then we can craft next phase of that this one <laughs> see and then we can craft the next phase yeah again dawn's end right i don't see where you'd use it but you can craft the next one which is voltage jade and then the next one which is state phaser what this is for, I have no clue. So, someone out there maybe can tell me. <laughs> okay, thank you, Atlas. So that's why I've been going to the Atlases, because I've been collecting their stuff. And maybe that's how you get all the recipes? I don't know. Or, yeah, I'm not too sure. I'm trying to figure that out. And that's part of the the game, right? I imagine once you figure it out, then maybe the game is not as interesting anymore. Who knows? Or maybe you never do figure out. It's just it's like, huh? Just to keep you playing, to keep you going, to keep doing whatever the Atlas wants. Let's see here. Let's collect these. Now I'm just, I, I I'm kind of curious to see if my game is broken. But this is my main game where I've unlocked everything with. So I'm not sure if the if all the money uh, translates through. So like the credits and stuff I think are just tied to this uh, save game. I think I would be willing to do other, like another save game. If I all of a sudden blew up, you know, had a thousand subs. Then I think I would entertain kind of creating new, like a new one to it. But for now, we'll just use this. It's on normal settings, the game. And yeah, here we go. See? So that's how we do it. That's how we do it. So I'm going to fly back to my freighter there. And 
yeah, I'll meet you in the next uh, system. And here we are into the next system, Remarv system. Perfect. So we are going to do the usual. Um, yeah, we're going to survey first. If we stick around long enough to build a base, then I think what we'll do is we shall kind of do an expedition so that, you, that way you can see kind of like how that works. But yeah, let us hop into our spaceship here. Let's tag along for the ride. Okay, let's go. Let's see what this has. Please be something good. Please be something good. Du, du, this doesn't look too promising. So that is uh, copper, uranium, and cobalt. High, uh, high sentinel activity. That is definitely okay. Here we go. There's some more planets here. There's also a moon. Looks like. Did this one? Did we do this one? I think we did this one first. Yes. Okay. So we can do this one. So there's a planet behind this one, or like a moon. Copper, gold, salt. High sentinel. Interesting. Interesting. That would be an interesting planet to check out. Shell strewn planet. Okay. And let's see what's. Oh, these are like some. Oh, yeah, that's right. My capital ship. So let's do this one. Copper, ammonia, salt, caustic planet, moon. Copper, uranium, silver. Interesting, okay. And there's one more moon. There's the moon in behind this planet. So let's, let's pulse. I think the pulse stopped because it was too close to a large spaceship. Let's recharge our pulse engine. So where is that moon? Let's see, where is that? Did I scan that already? Yes, so where is that other one? Okay, uh, how are we going to get to it? Maybe we'll fly to this one. Okay, and then... Oh, here we go. Is that it? No? Come on. Is this one? Ah, uh, is this it? I think this is it. No, I'm mapped. This is a big ass planet, man. But see, there's that little ball. So there's this little. So it's showing that it's in behind this planet. So ah, uh, we're gonna have to deal with some ships, I think. Must have expensive stuff, so. From where? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Where's the other ship? Okay, that was a good battle. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Okay, so let's fly to this place. We'll get a different angle on that planet. Oh, shit. 
Okay, so we have... Ah, okay, so maybe that's the one that I already did scan. Okay, so there's that one, there's that one. There's that one. Right, and then there was... Planet on the other side of this. Um, let's see, how can we get to... This, this place is huge. Let's go... F it, you know, I'm gonna keep going. This is too big of a system. Let's see if I go... Two, three, four, five. No, maybe I didn't miss anything. I might have missed one of these moons. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. So we have this. Two. Did the one with the rings. Three. Uh, I might be missing one, but whatever. You know what? Whatever. On to the next system. This is good enough. No, not good enough. So let's carry on. Where's my freighter? Capital ship. Is this the bottom side? This is the bottom side. There we go. Ooh, yeah. Now we're docking. Awesome. Well, on to the next system. So I will see you over there. Excellent. Here we are. Another successful warp. Rygrin's system. First contact. Let's take a peek into here. Let's upload all these so we can get credit. Oh, yes. Collecting those nanites. Ooh, we're getting a few of these. Pretty cool. 14 of 16. Almost. Almost. We can see what they are. Oh, yes. My wonderful spaceships. Hey. Okay. See what this place has to offer. I'm glad you got to see that combat. That's awesome. Let's see here. Now you know why I like this ship. Uh, there's a station here and a nice big planet. Boy, please have something good. Please have something good. Ah, uh, shit. <laughs> and I think there's two here. So right there, there's a planet. It has so it's this one. This is a, an ocean planet, looks like. Uh, no freezing. Copper dioxide magnetized ferrite. This one. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, back onto our ship. This is definitely not not acceptable, that's for sure. No. Right here. Boom. Boom shakalaka. Now I might spare you all the footage, it's all the same stuff, coming in, going out, coming in, going out. So if I find a good system along the way, I will stop and record it. If I see, if we get to the Atlas, then I think we'll end the episode with us arriving at the Atlas system. So yeah, so hopefully we find a good, um, good system. Uh, no, that's no good. <laughs> see, it's not even worth looking at. Now you can raise the class of the vehicles, so I could make mine an exotic class, like a class S. But 
yeah, I don't know. I would rather find it. Uh, find it in this in this whole thing. Oh, there's the pilot. Let's see what they have on their ship. Oh man. <laughs> Class C. I imagine we would have to go to like a higher higher system. So yeah, so I t yeah, so I'll see you all in a moment. Yep, I'm still looking for stuff, but I just want to show this for a little bit. So here we have the whole warp cell thing, and I'm gonna try using this. Let's see how much you know. one. Okay, so we didn't need to do the other one, the more expensive one. So we should do the cheaper one. So good thing we checked. I. I still have a bunch of those. I have five more of those, but now I know I can just use the regular warp cells. So yeah, so we're still moving on to our next system. I I looked outside. I, I didn't like this system, so we are moving to the next Atlas station. Now this Atlas station, I don't know where it's taking me. It's it's taking me, but it's not like. Like these galaxies are huge, right? So I guess we could be exploring forever in this in, in this space. <laughs> so let's see here. Let's go right to this system. We're gonna have to build a base, of course, but it's the whole point of this. But will we ever find a place? I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what tag along with me and if this is a good system then great we'll we'll place our our base and the next episode will be base building i was going to show the the community event but yeah i don't, I don't know i'm not going to get to that in this episode i don't think um oh we got 16 out of 16 nice 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 now what i wonder if the Will be an update. Now what? Now what? This is what I'm doing right now. Good question. No idea. So yeah. Oh wait a second. So does it say uh, it asks for seeds? I feel compelled to obey. Yeah, but it just tells me to find it, find it, find it, and it just it carries on. I don't have to build these seeds seems well anyways let's let's go on and check outside and call it an episode hope you enjoyed this episode hope you had a blast with me here on my adventures nothing too exciting but that's what this game is it's it's a lot like that any other planets this one the station Oh yeah, here we go. We got this one here. Copper, phosphorus, cobalt. How about this one? Will this be the, the money planets? Fungal, copper, and ammonia. So these these worlds have ancient bones on both of them. No way. I thought this one did too. Never mind. So just the one. I thought they both. Or is that that one over here? Ancient bones. Okay, interesting. But unfortunately, this is a bust. So, so we're gonna end the episode here. So, thank you everybody for watching. Hopefully, you've enjoyed this episode with me. I imagine there'll be more adventures that we're going to get along with, and we'll see what the comments you do. And yeah, thank you. And you all have a wonderful day. Bye bye.